for our first of two heavyweight elimination bouts. Ken Bell, who has studied for years in Hawaii. Remember, heavyweight is 176 pounds and up. And his opponent, who has lived and studied and worked in Hawaii, Dana Goodson. Dana has finished second in this competition a few years ago as he fought in Hawaii. The two gentlemen in the middle of the ring, Ken Bell to the left, Dana Goodson right. Referee checks for foreign objects, preparing the fighters for their fight. Making sure that the scorers and everyone around the ringside has all the instructions. Good shot of Dana Goodson. Good, good athlete, strong, very strong. And that's Ken Bell, Dana's opponent, and it's going to be a barn burner. Bob, what do you think about Dana Goodson? Dana Goodson, one of the best fighters in Hawaii, if not the very best fighter. All right, the heavyweights now. Here we go. Benny Goodson, uh, Dana Goodson, rather, against Ken Bell. Ken Bell with the T-shirt on. Oh, and a good left. Dana Goodson with the long top on. Jumping side kick, which Goodson evades. Spinning round to the back of the leg and a right hand to the back of the head by Goodson. Front kick. And when, each, when each one of those moves, each one of those executions, an athlete scores points. And just above our microphones here, the referee tells him to take it easy, separates them, pulls them apart, puts them back at the starting point, and we'll, we'll have another go in. Here we go. Spinning back kick was blocked by Bell. So that maneuver did not score. Spinning round. Oh, a devastating spinning round by Dana Goodson, which I imagine will be a takedown two-point score. Just at the bell. Beautifully executed by Goodson. Coming up on the slow motion now, you see that kick that took Ken Bell down by Dana Goodson. Just at the bell. There's a spinning round. Bell's very susceptible to it, and he's down again. He's got Bell down again. That's another sweep takedown two-pointer. Those spinning sweeps of the back leg really take their toll. I tell you, Bell is going to have to start picking up that forward leg and avoiding that. just above our microphones again tells him to relax and here we go so he's back on the starting marks and we're off again one of those come over you're going to catch him for me aren't you Ralph? yeah i'm going to do my best <laughs> oh a good right, right hand, hand goodson. by goodson but bell comes right back looks like bell's tiring a little yeah i think his conditioning is going to be important yeah, i guess i guess those again that spinning sweep goodson's working very effectively he didn't get him down that time but takes his toll on that leg mr ken bell has his hands full now he's got to make up the deficit and pull ahead so he's got to really show some stuff here. but i don't think dana goodson is quite ready to let him run away with it so he's going to really have to fight for it Dana Goodson's had a lot of experience. He's full contact. There it is. There it is. He scored heavily with that left and right sweep combination. They're all trying to indicate he didn't hurt him. But right. But oh, oh, that right hand. Oh, he's out. I Lights think. out. He hit hard. Bear. He hit awfully hard. On his feet. Ken Bell is still out on his feet. I certainly say, hate to see him try to continue. I don't think he's out on his feet. In slow motion now, here's the blow that did it. Look at his head pop back as, as he got, Ken Bell got hit with a terrific right hand by Dana Goodson and he goes crashing to the floor. Oh, he fell heavily. His head really hit the canvas. Yes, it did. And from our vantage